Well, I've gotten a lot of stuff. Now, this should improve the gaming channel, but actually I've got this. I've got a PlayStation camera, and then recently I've just ordered, um, with help from parents, uh, a PlayStation VR. Now, things are on sale. I think it's because of the days of play thing. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm excited because there's a Star Wars VR Battlefront thing that I've always wanted to try. So it'll be very nice to see how we do this, and yeah, let's go into the unboxing video. Right then, so let's open this big bad boy up. PlayStation VR, PlayStation VR World Games, and the camera. I've already got that. Yeah. Okay. How do I... Station, got that. Um, since I could be of the guy, that should be useful later. We can just get all of this out. Aha, and it seems to me we found the grand prize. Let's just get another angle. I'm sure this is better anyway. Okay. Um, so let's open it. <laughs> wow. Feels. And this is the VR. Take these off, and yeah, it looks very good. It does. Um, as you know, I'm gonna have to set all of this up. Just wanna get this through. Um, I'm guessing these two ports go to somewhere where I've been given. Um, and there's like a little head strap. Um, yeah, I'm very excited to check to do that. Now, let's see what's in here. So, there's some manuals uh, you have. I shall put that there. You've got um, PlayStation. VR Worlds, just want to cover it up. That's for me, not for you. Screen cleaner. And the rest of the things I'm going to show you. Um, I'm guessing this is the box of how all of this connects. Um, you guys give me one second. I'm able to show you all of this. Oh, I've never seen anything like this before. Okay, I'll be able to figure it out. A cable. A cable that looks like a PC charger thing. I bet not. I'm guessing these are the headphones. To do. Stand for the PlayStation camera. The, uh, the PlayStation camera. And another cable. Did it say anything on the box? You must be asking. 
Uh, it's not in prime condition for me to show you, but now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start to set all of this up so I'll see you in a while. Six and a half hours later. So it's night time now. I look hideous, but um, we got everything to work. We did. But here's one thing. This tool, this controller, is not connecting to the PlayStation VR or to the con. It's not. It's just not just working. So I have a question for you. For instance, is this supposed to work? I understand with videos, and if it is, how do you get it to work? And second, just how? Just please help us. It's connected, it is, but when we get into the game, it's coloured, and then it goes off, and we have to use the dual truck. So, yeah, I'm not sure if I'll be able to show gameplay now, but later in the video, hopefully, I will. Six and a half hours later. So now I've just had a bit of a playtest with uh, Spider-Man Homecoming VR. We will be playing other games for this channel. But here's how we're going to do this. I think for VR-wise, we're going to do commentary for you guys for this channel. And then these games we won't be because I don't do commentary on those. Because I find it annoying when I have to do evolution videos and there's commentary and then I have to be music on it. Oh, you don't understand. Anyway, but today we're going to be playing Spider-Man Homecoming. Hopefully you've seen the film. If not, here's a short, here's a clip from that film and then we'll get started. Alright then. So, hopefully the gameplay is now up. And that's Spider-Man over there. It does get dirty in here, so it's like you can't see that much. And also, you have to hold the headset most of the time, while other people don't say. I can't even do this. It's not quite bad, to be honest. Um, get your brain moving. I do want to apologise for the lack of uh, videos, by the way. I should do a few of the PlayStation VR. I'm not too sure how you guys can see it, because for me it's like all dirty. Let's move home and see that pizza has. Oh, my queens. This is your new high-tech suit. Please put on the mask. This suit is designed to fit your specific dimensions exactly. Please review the fit and finish in the reflective surface of your body. If you're done admiring yourself, I can show you some of the other functions of the suit. Aren't you attractive? We must calibrate your web functions. Initiating your new web shooters. Initiating rapid fire web. First mode. Hold your web shooter to shoot web repeatedly. Try hitting that bottle. One comment I got, hey, you should do some commentary. But this is what my commentary is. I talk when I feel like it. I'm not like, oh my god! Oh, that just happened! Because it's just, to me, it's just a game. I don't know if I'm maybe, but. I don't know, like, when have I ever played that? I was saying 7 1. Well, it's probably 19, but you know. Exactly, fire shooter. Calibrated. Fire shooter thing is, we do no this, you can see above average. Initiating a web grenade. Charged grenade mode. Hold the trigger button to charge your grenade. We're moving a large degree over there. Please remember. 
remember to train harder. Initiating web sling. This one may work. Press and hold the web shooter to launch and connect web sling to an object. Try to move the poster from the wall over there. readings are coming from your location. Please get to higher ground for more detailed analysis. There is a crane 400 feet above you. Engage web sling to ascend. In total, what do I actually think of the PlayStation VR? Well, the PlayStation VR is very, very good. It is a pain to set up, I won't admit, and it is a pain to record stuff, but eventually you do get that. There are many VR experiences you can try, not just for free, but you can pay for some. So expect more VR stuff coming soon. Anyway, and I guess there will a few one day.